lot of people are talking about a new AI model that OpenAI might have released. This model has been spotted in the chatbot arena, a platform where you can compare AI models by asking them to respond to the same queries. The model in question is labeled as GPT-2 chatbot, and it's showing surprisingly good results, which has led to speculation that it might be something like GPT-4.5 or even GPT-5. The chatbot arena serves as a battleground where two AI systems can be tested side by side. You enter a question and two AI systems provide their answers, which are then evaluated by users. These evaluations influence the model's rankings on the site. Recently, the GPT-2 chatbot has been performing exceptionally well, often outperforming the current GPT-4 model. This exceptional performance has sparked conversations about whether OpenAI is testing a new model in a real-world application without making a formal announcement. The intrigue began a few days ago when users on the platform noticed the high-quality responses from the GPT-2 chatbot, particularly in reasoning and coding tasks. For instance, in one test, the GPT-2 was the only model to accurately count the number of characters in a string, outperforming other models like Llama 3 and GPT-4. In another example, during a reasoning task about apples, where many models failed, the GPT-2 chatbot managed to correctly reason that if Tommy has two apples today and ate one yesterday, he still has two apples today. This logical processing showcased its superior understanding. Moreover, in a coding challenge to create a game using JavaScript within a single HTML document, the GPT-2 not only succeeded, but did so with a functionality that was notably better than what other models, including GPT-4, could achieve. It created a playable game resembling a simple version of Space Invaders, where the player must collect points, demonstrating a more complex coding capability than its counterparts. Sam Altman, CEO of OpenAI, added to the speculation by tweeting about his fondness for GPT-2, which many have taken as a hint towards this new model. His tweet suggests that he might be referring to this new AI being tested under the guise of GPT-2 chatbot rather than the older GPT-2 model. Despite its promising abilities, the GPT-2 remains a bit of a mystery due to its limited availability for interaction and its absence from public leaderboards and API access. This secrecy has sparked various theories about its true capabilities and origins. Some community members suggest it might be a fine-tuned version of GPT-4 designed to test minor improvements improvements in a live setting. This theory is supported by the fact that while the GPT-2 has shown impressive outputs, it has also demonstrated some inconsistencies, like occasionally using flawed reasoning or not surpassing GPT-4 in every task. The discussion about this model also includes some skepticism about whether it truly represents a major advancement like GPT-5. While it has shown advanced capabilities in specific tasks, the overall leap in performance compared to previous models isn't as large as some might expect for a next generation. Generation AI. This has led to a tempered expectation that it might be more of a step towards GPT-4.5 rather than a full leap to GPT-5. Furthermore, the decision to label this model as GPT-2 has caused confusion and speculation. It's possible that OpenAI chose this name as a strategic move to conduct testing without attracting too much attention. Or it might simply be a temporary label that led to unintended speculation. The name GPT-2 is intriguing because it suggests a connection to earlier models, yet the performance of this chatbot suggests something much more advanced. In any case, the emergence of the GPT-2 chatbot has sparked significant interest and debate within the AI community. Its capabilities, particularly in coding and reasoning tasks, have set it apart from other models currently available. As more people engage with the chatbot arena and continue to test this model, we will likely gain a clearer understanding of its capabilities and perhaps receive more information from OpenAI about what exactly this GPT-2 represents in the evolution of AI models. All right, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more updates. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll catch you in the next one.